We stated the case that the private markets have historically outperformed major public market indices. We also know institutional investors have long been able to access these strategies and participate in this outperformance. But there's another group looking to take part in some of the action, private wealth. Globally, private wealth AUM is estimated to be $122 trillion by the end of 2023. So what is this group actually investing in? In 2023, individual investors held approximately 15% of the estimated $275 trillion of global AUM, but they only represented 16% of AUM held by alternative investment funds. The private wealth channel to date has been extremely underpenetrated when it comes to their alternatives exposure. Their current allocations are around only 2% on average. We recently surveyed a global set of private wealth managers, and we asked them how much they planned to allocate to the private markets in 2024, and whether this was a change from the prior year. What were the results? Close to 75% of respondents are looking to increase their allocation from last year. And keep in mind, this is in a time when institutional fundraising is perceived to be weak. I'm going to leave you with a few thoughts around private wealth. First, Increased allocations to private markets from this channel will most likely continue. And why wouldn't it? It's a return-driven market and the returns are just better. If we were to look ahead to the Hamilton Lane 2034 market overview, we just might be showing private wealth investors on average allocating 50% of their portfolios to private market strategies. Secondly, we believe innovation in private investing structures and strategies will be driven by private wealth and not the institutional side. The demand for information, innovative structures, transparency, and data will all be driven by the private wealth channel.